A lot of questions this afternoon about the death of a family in Garden Grove. The parents and children were all found dead inside a minivan. Their bodies were discovered by someone who walked by the van in the parking lot of a CVS store on Brookhurst. KKL 9's Candace Crone is there with the investigation. The family's van was parked right here in the parking lot of the CVS. A homeless woman who was walking by the van noticed that things didn't look right, and she immediately called 911. It's kind of odd to me that it was sitting there and it hadn't been moved at all. Ty Stanfield says he saw this white Honda minivan backed into the same stall for several days, but didn't want to bother whoever was inside. Last night, a woman walking by smelled a strong, foul odor coming from the van and called for help. Police arrived and found the bodies of two adults and two young kids inside. Detectives believe the family was homeless and living out of their van. So it appears that the van backed into a parking stall and they may have succumbed to either some carbon monoxide poisoning because there's no obvious signs of trauma. But based on what we've seen, it looks like it was a tragic accident at this point. The van was parked there for four days and I just don't know how anyone could miss it because it. I do remember the smell now earlier that day. Investigators believe the family was trying to keep warm at night and are looking into if carbon monoxide played a role in their deaths. They do not suspect foul play and are treating this as an accident. People who hang out in the area often saw the family parked outside of CVS and are shocked by their deaths. I would give them stuff when I had extra. I would give it to them and help them out. And they, they were very polite and very respectful parents. There were no obvious signs of trauma to the victims' bodies. The coroner is now looking into the cause of their deaths. Reporting in Garden Grove, Candace Crone, KCAL 9 News.